one of the most reliable source of information and knowledge is a library. The desire to know leads one to a library. Today, we will visit a unique source of knowledge, the Besançon Conservation Library in France. Amongst the thousands of books therein, we will find one of the most beautiful classics of Aristotle, who lived from 384 to 322 BC. He was a Greek philosopher and polymath during the classic period in ancient Greece. This book is quite interesting. It is Aristotle's most complete work on ethics, also called Nicomachean Ethics, which refers to the name of his father, Nicomachus, a physician to Amitus II, the king of Macedonia. This particular edition is the Latin first volume of 1535 in octavo format, a rare edition of Aristotle's Nicomachean Ethics, translated by the Byzantine scholar John Agiropoulos. We can see the features of the title page is quite unique, with specific names in red ink and beautiful engraving of the bookseller bearing the motto in domino confido which means in the lord i trust this edition bears other significant collaborators as you can see on the title page namely joannis agilopili who was specialized in translating greek philosophical and theological works into latin jacobi fabris Stepulensis, the commentator from Etape, France, with the French name Le Fèvre de Table Jacques. Printed in Logduni, also known as Lyon, in 1535 by Boni Benoit. The name is reviewed at the end of this book as Benedict Boni, with his signature. However, this copy was printed by him for the famous Florence and Venice bookseller family of Jacob Gunther, who owns the publisher's symbol on the title page. The S. Libris is for the Besançon Conservation Library. We can also notice the different and style typography of this copy. Here on the left is the main text while the other is the commentary. This copy, though old, still has a good binding in full calfskin, with three line fillets in the center and border of the book, designed with gilded floral ornament. There are minor frictions and missing leather at the bottom of the spine. The additional text of Leonardo Artini with the title the Morals of Dialogue, Galiotum. The work of Aristotle stands as one of the greatest classics of moral philosophy and still influential to your death.